So the terrain here is definitely getting steeper and more committing. But you know, so much of survival is about just trying to be resourceful. I just wonder if maybe we maybe use that old trunk. Use that, get that down, and then we can down climb that. Let's have a look at it anyway. Yeah. <laughs> Is there some way we can use our axe to make a ladder out of that? Yeah, brilliant idea. <laughs> brilliant. <laughs> totally. Maybe if we, like, cut little steps into it. Uh -huh. It doesn't have to be big, you know, just enough to use his hands and feet, drag it, drop it down, maybe tie this rope to the end of it so it stays in place. Sure. We pass this old log on the way down. Have you got that axe on you? Yeah. Let's bring the axe up here. And, of course, because the air is so dry out here, nothing really rots. Rock hard though, uh, this wood. But whatever it was used for one time, we're going to use it for our purpose, which is getting down this crack. So, look, if you give us the axe, what we're trying to do is trying to get, we could cut some little steps into it and drop it down this crack and use those and down climb. Let's get you doing a bit of that. We get this rope ready and then we're into it. Bear's plan is to somehow climb down this log ladder that we've built from our two hands and an axe. Okay, so that's a bunch of steps cut and now we've got to do is position this. So if you take the heavy end. Alright. <laughs> I'll take this end, you ready? And that way. We're going down to the right, yeah. yeah. Oh my god, I don't know. <laughs> you crack me up. Here we go, right? It's literally like he's moving a matchstick. <laughs> so heavy. Well, the great thing about having Dave Batista on this journey is that when you're moving heavy tree trunks around, it suddenly all becomes a little bit easier. OK, watch your step down there. We'll let gravity do the work now if you put it down. And then we'll come up this end. I feel OK climbing down this log. Uh, right now, but as Mike Tyson said, everybody always has a plan until they get punched in the face. So I'll see <laughs> how it starts looking when we're, we're actually doing this. But as of right now, I'm extremely confident. <laughs> so when I go down, am I going down like keeping my weight on the rope, or should I try to balance myself? A bit of both. A bit of a bit both. Of both. Okay, yeah, cool. as it gets steeper, it's going to be more natural to use your hands and stuff and your okay. feet as well. So, okay. OK, tell me when you're at the top. Uh, not yet. Almost. OK, I got my okay, foot on. OK, now try and use the log, cos I'm going to... I'm struggling to hold you on that one, so... OK, all right. Are you talking to me? Are you on it? I can't see you now. Yep, I'm on the log. And these notches are... Uh, much farther apart than I thought. <laughs> OK, I'm down. I made it. OK, good job. OK, I'm going to follow you down this line. That worked pretty good, didn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, look at that. <laughs> good job. <laughs> Well done. Okay. I'm not going to lie, it was a little scary. There was a couple times where I just wanted to wrap myself around the log and hopefully slide down.